traded some VW stock for the staggered set of nines in the front and tens in the rear. I hate the wheels. If it just had normal wheels on it, it'd be fine. Yeah. If it was just a normal car, everything would be fine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Jack writes in, February 2023, Reader's Rides. Only thing better than one Japanese shitbox is two Japanese shitbox. Hello from Australia, fellas. Recently found your channel and have been binging your vids. <sighs> Thought I'd chuck in a submission for your view by your based takes, so here goes. My 2001 Honda Prelude VTIR. This has been my first car. Bought it three years ago for 4,500 Australia bucks and have been steadily working on it to be a relatively stock fun daily. Unfortunately, an auto but sporting the 200 horsepower from the 2 liter H22Z1, so it is a great drive. List of what I have done to it. K-Sport coilovers, way too low, Angel Eye headlights, custom fabricated exhaust, Avid AVO 618 inch wheels, he wishes he got smaller, semi-open door resprays, engine bay and such left out. Okay, so he repainted it to a Toyota color. Very cool. Mica blue, and it looks like that. Before That's and after. That's a pretty hey. good first car. That blue's yeah. not bad. No. Automatic. I don't, eh. I don't hate it. Yeah, like almost all Rip of these wheels. are automatic though, right? Yeah, there's very few. And all he has to do now is put it on a boat to the States and he could probably triple his money. Honestly, yeah, he could probably just ship those things over here and, and double or triple his money. Yeah, he's flexing the um, the door jams, showing you that they Ooh. match the outside. Yeah. Very nice. Fancy I, I don't like the headlights. Just at all? It, it, no, it, it, <laughs> he has those eBay projectors. Oh, I gotcha. Oh, I see what you're saying. Should have polished the stock ones. Yeah. This episode's brought to you by Fritos. What variety of Fritos? Just regular or flaming Hot or what? No, just regular. Oh, the okay, original. Okay. The just original corn cheese. chips. Uh, you know what Fritos is, is underrated is the uh, they got chili, like a chili one. Yes, the chili yeah. ones. Those, yeah, are, those so are good. Bad. And the fucking twists ones, the tornadoes or whatever the f yeah, yeah, those are, those are fire. I know what I like. I like Frito. Ooh, Texas Grill. Did you know, like, the Frito mascot used to be, like, crazy racist? No. The Frito Bandito. Actually, I did know that. The Frito, the Frito yeah. Bandito. Yeah. <laughs> Let's uh, pull him up like, real quick. He was, like, high key based. <laughs> Hello, this my is... friends. Hello, my friends. I am the Frito <laughs> Bandito. Oh, I am here to bring you Fritos. Oh, let, me, let me hear his voice. Or do you want to be a Frito Bandito like me? Oh, exactly okay, the same. okay. That's how what? it talks. Do you want to be Frito Bandito? Is this offensive? Like, I know that like Mexicans like Speedy Gonzalez, right? Right. I was going to say, yeah, this Speedy is Gonzalez about is as sick. offensive yeah. as Speedy Gonzalez. Like, so I think it's the same, same voice actor. <laughs> it might be. <laughs> it might be. I want Fritos. I mean, I don't think it would come out now, but for the time, there's so much worse out there. Basically yeah. anything that Walt Disney made. Uchi is the expert of racism. Yeah. We can no longer beat this pinata. <laughs> oh god, that sounds really racist. <laughs> Godly Shit. Madden. <laughs> Guest chat. Casual racism is fun, and then his reply, not everyone is cut out for competitive. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but like, oh, Speedy, Speedy Gonzalez was based, but if, if like, to be racist, they threw in his fucking cousin. Yeah. Uh, Slowpoke. Slowpoke Rodriguez. <laughs> that dude was a shitbag. <laughs> he was a shitbag. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> That's what I wanted to tell you. Guy Slowpoke Rodriguez. Violent. He packed a gun. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Slowpoke is ice cold. God created cats and mice. Mm -hmm. And Winchester made them equal. <laughs> Damn. Real. So Japanese boxes yeah, so yeah. Back, back to this he also has jack also has a uh, s13 it looks like overall there are a few things i would have done differently but as my first car i'm very proud of it i am pretty proud of it and have learned some lessons for my second car my 1990 nissan sylvia q's had this thing for just a couple weeks now and i'm excited to work on it car was a factory auto with a ca18 de but has been swapped to a manual with an sr20 de not too much to say besides that for this thing paint is pretty fucked and the interior needs a little bit of attention just minor things like speakers and sagging door cars lining but is overall extremely clean and completely stock my plan is to get it cleaned up and put on some 15 inch watanabe reps like rota rkrs some bc coilovers get it resprayed either back to the same color or a two-tone i still haven't decided after i've done all the cosmetic work and i got it pretty much oem plus i'm gonna build the motor to try to push around 300 horsepower na with some itbs that sounds like oh, quite the dream that's, uh, well, that's like, a tall order. That's a tall this order. has been a couple of months now so like if you're around oh yeah know. studlers yeah. and youtube says what's up with the hood it's open. Yeah, it's just open. <laughs> uh, if you haven't done That's the respray the engine yet, gets put in this there. dude, Studler's never wrenched on a car before, I can tell. <laughs> before you do the respray, just, just repaint it back to the factory color. We don't need to do a color change here. It looks very nice. Yeah, I like that blue. Yeah. 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 There's both of them in one picture. Oh, they match. Kind of. The Honda's painted Toyota blue, but we're close. <laughs> I don't mind the Preludes. I, they're not like as underrated as I always think there are because like people clearly know about Preludes, but yeah. like. 
They're all right. Those are cool. Be cool. Like, yeah, maybe, I like commuter. These are good maybe, looking cars. Wait, mm-hmm. this one's an auto though. That's not cool. There's there's very few of this journey. I believe this is the fifth gen prelude. There's there's like almost no manuals. Like they're really? almost they're almost all autos, I believe. But I wouldn't I wouldn't even mind an auto because this would this would be a very nice, cool, sporty daily pizza, that's economical pizza delivery and car. Yeah. It looks cool. A yeah. prelude is maybe the only Honda I would like. That uh, may, it is. I'm not gonna say maybe. Uh Prelude is the only Honda that like, like I appreciate. When oh. a Civic is too normy for you. Yeah. Or for daily you know, commute, you buy too, this. Too direct yeah. for you. I don't appreciate it. Yeah. So I can do that or I'll say it. <laughs> I like the um right. I like the Accord Coupe, the V6 Accord Coupe. Those are cool. Oh, maybe. Yeah. But aside from that, yeah. Well, no, I like Civics too. Given the choice between Prelude and a Civic, I'm gonna pick a Prelude all day. Try to talk some shit. Discord.gg slash feed. Let's talk some shit. Give me your money. 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 All new sticker designs and our classics are available at collectorcarfeed.com slash store. Give me your money. Adam, CCF Raiders Ride Submission. Let me read that again. Adam, CCF Raiders Ride <laughs> Submission. What's up, CCF? Damn, this is long. What's up, CCF? I recently I discovered God, some of your videos. I'm not reading all this. I recently discovered some Good. of your videos on the hell that is the S Chassis Marketplace. Hey, remember when we used to do those videos? And found them to be funny, <laughs> but also very truthful in how the rough how rough the market is. Anyways, figured I'd submit my rides with a few key points on each. 91 240SX SE Coupe. It's rust free. He bought it for sixty seven hundred bucks. Has one hundred ten thousand miles, crackless dash, a bunch of other stuff. It's got a KA in there. Pretty sick. Um, Good buy. Not, I can't. I can't read all that, dude. But sixty seven hundred bucks, one hundred ten k. Not bad. Yeah. Got the Advans, Paxi Cat back, BC Racing, gross. Corbo seats. Um, K K twenty four DE. This dude did well. Yeah. No, Basic really shit. Well. Pretty nice. He also has a 2006 Lexus LS430 Ultra Luxury. Very cool. It's got the reclining rear yeah. seats and the air conditioning and all that shit in the back. Is that back. what UL stands for? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Ultra know. Luxury. I had no idea. That's, that's the uh, top of the line LS430. Recently acquired summer of 2022. Recently. Selling my first car to purchase this one. I threw on the imported Club Linea. We're done. We're done. He put on some, some weird wheels. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, Ultra Luxury with the executive package is the oh. highest trend. What do you get on the executive package? We got a new shirt from Bobby Sausage. I wouldn't mind an automatic. <laughs> <Heck you're 57. laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Very nice. All right, back to this though. He he's got that ultra luxury. It's nice. He also says that his first car was an Impreza 2.5i with a 5 MT in A and slower than hell, but fun. Sold it due to typical head gasket problems after they had already been replaced once before. Typical Subaru. Sh- I beat the piss out of it. Oh, okay. And had all sorts of fun with it. I miss it, typical but I'm Subaru also shit. typical Subaru shit. I miss it, but I'm also <laughs> glad I did a lot of my first car wrenching on a car that is generally depicted as less sought after enthusiast car rather than making mistakes on my beloved S13. Hey, this guy's all right. Cool guy. Yeah, yeah, cool guy. Uh, anyways, sorry for writing a eulogy. Figured I'd give you guys the ins and outs of each car. Let me know what your opinions are. I think you wrote too much, but I think that S13 is really nice. <laughs> your girl's ugly. Your girl's ugly. Your sir. Girl's ugly. Jesus. <laughs> I don't I don't like the nice seats because they're dude. probably too small for me. The Corbos. So I don't like the seats. Yeah. A little too tight. A little too are tight. You big, are you a big boy? I I am a standard American, sir, so yes, I'm a big boy. He's got I'm those birthing hips, dude. <laughs> exactly. Oh shit. <laughs> those breedable hips. That's a nice S thirteen for I think he said sixty eight hundred bucks. Yeah, sixty seven hundred. Yeah. yeah. Six, Great sixty seven hundred bucks. Yeah. Nice buy. Great buy. Keep the headlights down. Take all the stickers off. Uh, you know, unless you got CCF one on there, leave that on. But uh, yeah, 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 yeah. But yeah, no, nice. And the ultra luxury, very fucking cool. Hell yeah, oh, I love those I, wheels. I was gonna say I don't like those wheels, but I, you know what, I love them. I want them. That yeah. bump sticker. Yeah. This car climbed Mount Washington. Yeah. Is that his girl's name? <laughs> hey. <laughs> you bitch fat. <laughs> Do you live in a society, but belong in a society? Do you play bass guitar, but wish you were blasting trumpets? Fear not, rude boy, for a benevolent god has created Collector Car Feed, bestowed onto you. At CollectorCarFeed.com, you can use our search tool to easily browse thousands of active vehicle listings for neoclassic cars and trucks. Find exactly the car you want and set your wallet on fire with the help of CollectorCarFeed.com. Thanks to Collector Car Feed, I got my very own 370Z without the hassle of using those other used car sites and apps. A blasting trumpet's throwing that sh- sideways and deaf as f- 
The ladies love it too, and I tell you about that, but- This voiceover actor wouldn't say the line. This voiceover actor thinks your line was cheap and too on the nose. <coughs> Just like me and your mom on Friday night- CollectorCarfee.com Find the f***ing car you f***ing wanted instead of a bunch of f***ing bullshit at CollectorCarfee.com Irving, rate my daily. Keep up the great work. Smiley face. Don't even know how I found the channel. I was just listening to YouTube videos while I was working, and here I am watching your guys' videos whenever I have to pretend that I know what I'm doing while at work. Love the content. Do you guys plan on ever selling hats or anything like that? Uh, ho oh, ho, wouldn't you like to know? Anyways, I know you guys just love VWs, so here's my daily Passat. Nothing crazy. It's a 2002 1.8 turbo 5-speed. Definitely wasn't my first choice, but after my other VW, after my other VW died, Mark IV GTI, also 1.8T. But this fell on my lap, and as time has went on, I grew to love it traded some VW stock for the staggered set of nines in the front and tens in the rear. Might have pull slash roll fenders in the rear like an eighth of an inch for some clearance. Have at it, lol. I'd love to hear what you guys think. Well, That's as it. the resident VW fan, I yeah. can bottom text tell you it stinks. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Damn. Got him. It's shit. Yeah, I it's, hate um, the wheels. I really don't like the wheels. I if it just had normal wheels on it, it'd be fine. Yeah. If it was just a normal car, everything would be fine. Yeah. <laughs> Picked up for 800 bucks a few weeks ago. This is from Dr. Lugs. Was a trade-in at work. Has oh, air so you could <laughs> store meat in it. Shame it's an auto, but beggars can't be choosers when there's maybe 10 good ones left. Yeah, that's cool as f It's very Holy nice. Sh that's clean. It's very, very clean. It's like the cool um, Tercel. Yeah. That's Dude, exactly I right. Yeah, I, I guarantee you when you're done with this, you'll put it on cars and bids and some asshole will pay you five grand for this. Yeah, it's like the American yeah. Sarah with uh, just normal doors. I'll give you a thousand dollars for the for that car. Yeah, <laughs> that, that might be about retail. Hey, what's good with all of those uh, steel case leaps in the background, dude? Nice chairs. Yeah, I do. Cool. That's a nice Hell yeah. Thanks to worked V2, at a dog. Nissan dealer. I'm, I'm going to let you in on a little secret, dude. I'm sitting in one of these right I'm now. I'm literally just about to say my ass is firmly planted in a leap right now. Nice chair. No, it's a nice car, dude. Very nice. Marcus, rate me cars. Mazda RX-7 and Toyota Land Cruiser. Hi, firstly, I freaking love you guys, and your channel is funny as fuck and based. I wanted to see what y'all think of my lineup, since I'm pretty proud of it myself. First is a 1992 Toyota Land Cruiser with 210,000 miles, still runs like a champ, and is my daily. Not much done to it besides some basic maintenance and aftermarket parts, air filter, gaskets, etc. Let's take a look at that. There it is. And second <laughs> is my pride and joy, a 93 Mazda Affini RX-7. Has about 80,000 kilometers, or 49,000 miles, and is a right-hand drive import. It's bone stock, and I would like to keep it like that. I do plan to have the Apex seals replaced soon as well. Cool. Cool-ass car. Cool-ass yeah. Jeep. Oh, cool -ass. 70 series. Two Ooh, ten. Go two back. ten on that Land Cruiser. Oh, that's just getting hot. started. I know. That's gorgeous. It's still, it's still hot. It's still hot. It's hot. Yeah, but it's a Land Cruiser in name only, but that doesn't matter. It's well, hot. It's a Land Cruiser light. He's got a yeah. G5 sticker. That man hunts. And more of those. I don't know what, don't know what that means. I don't know G5, G5, but, uh, G5. Oh man, I wonder. I wonder if he survived the fires. <laughs> <laughs> oh. He does look like he's got money. He might have burned out. <laughs> oh fuck. <laughs> Rest in peace, man. R.I.P. Rip to a legend. He had some nice cars before that yeah. fire. He said that's got 210, 2000, 210k miles. Like shit, that thing's just getting started. Yeah, she's gonna live forever. Started. Unless it got well, burned those, up enough fire. Yeah, it's gonna outlive us unless it is currently the a Prados, pile the of The Prados don't have as 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 bulletproof yeah, an engine. Yeah. They're not as legendary as yeah. full size Land Cruisers. Yeah, Still but you know about though. cars that don't have bulletproof engines and you love them anyway. Yeah, but That's, but hey. I mean, it's just a fact. <laughs> <laughs> nice cars yep. i think we're gonna move yeah. on dominic j rate my vehicles first one to say i love the channel been binging all your videos because they are hilarious below are my three cars 92 mark 3 super turbo uh oh 76 000 miles on the body 15k on the swap it's a 1jz sick rolling on some ray grams and uh <laughs> what what ray's gram lights dog what <laughs> All right. And a list of mods too long to list. 2004 Mitsubishi Lancer Rally Art, 60,000 miles because I was too poor to afford an Evo. Recently found a four parts Evo, so I took the turbo manifold off of it, turbo and manifold off of it. Still waiting on some parts to install. Plans to repaint and get new wheels for it as well. And a 94 Mitsubishi 3000 GT VR4 with 121K on it. I know y'all hate this car, but she moves and it's pretty cool looking in my opinion. All stock except for a gasket overhaul and some other minor things. That's that's stock. When did we has say seen... we hated the 3000 GT? TVR4. Oh, no. We, we, we just talked about how they're unreliable vehicles, I think. Yeah, I don't think I've ever said that I had the 3000 They're, they're amazing, massive pieces of shit, basically. Yes. Yeah. 100% agree. Yeah. 
Yeah, but replacing gaskets is not a mod. That is a stock vehicle that has been maintained. <laughs> Interior has seen better days, and the passenger seatbelt doesn't work. I also plan to have the car repainted. And first up, we have that uh, Lancer rally art here. All right. Tight, tight. That'll work. And then we have a Mark III Supra with a 1JZ Sheesh. swapped into it. That's cool as shit. Imagine Bruh. thinking that car is not cool, Netgear. I, I can't imagine. Is Netgear the one smashing the bra button? It's not me. It's somebody else. <laughs> Shut up. <dude>. <laughs> <laughs> and then a 3000 GT VR4 that's uh, getting gang stalked by a new Edge Mustang there. <laughs> Let me just say, get a drink. the uh, the 3000 GT VR4, it could definitely use that respray you've been talking about. Yeah. Yep. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Get that passenger seatbelt fixed, but the since Necker's gone, we can talk openly about the super. No, it's I'm still fucking here. awesome. Oh. Uh, go, go get your drink, dude. Go, go get your drink. Go get your drink. Get out of here. Get out of here. No, and it's... you know what? Donut Media <laughs> said the Mark III sucks too. So, huh? You're I, green I, with Donut. Donut agrees with me. I don't know if that's good or bad. <laughs> that's that's so bad, dude. That I is don't know bad what to think about thing. that. And Anyways. this is this is that. So yeah, all right. Oh, well, the three thousand GT is nice. That Lancer is a good daily. You know, when the when sure. the, the, the when the super is like a hundred percent guaranteed to be broken, you can count on the Lancer. <laughs> it's a one J swam. Yeah, it's one J, dude. <laughs> oh, it's okay then. <laughs> sick. <laughs> Fucking sick. Cars. All right. Julian, based cat, shout out neck gear, and picture of a cat looking at its asshole. Nice. Based. Gunnar Re Cat. My first <laughs> car at 17, 71, 8, 71,8 K miles. And foreigners 400 <laughs> horsepower had for a year and a half at the time of sending this and it has been my daily no problems i put an aos on it and got rce tarmac zero coilovers put on it as it was on lowering springs and scraped everywhere which i hated have a roll center kit and sill four cooling mod that i still have to put on when i get the jacks when i get jacks or just pay someone <laughs> we're gonna stop reading your shit god uh, damn it god you spoke to a jack yeah Buy it. Yeah. I mean, that's sick. Hawkeyes are cool. We've already established they're the best ones. I don't want to hear a word otherwise. Yeah. Dog, that's not a that's not a Hawkeye. It's a stink eye, dude. I thought anything after 07 was like Hawkeye. No, I no, got catch all. No, it's uh, that's the last gen or that's the last facelift of the G G D. G D. What's this thing? Is this a stink eye? <laughs> no. Oh yeah. Well, no. The true the brown eye. True lore. <laughs> true lore is only the bug eye, hawk eye, only the bug eye, blah eye, and hawk eye carry the eye moniker. Everything yeah. else is 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 cope trying to force eye names on a WRXs for some reason. True. After that, just call it what it is. It's a fucking what is this? A twelve? Oh, it's an SEI. So just call it the fucking year. <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Don't. Why is what we're basically saying here? Gunnar is. You. Moving Don't try on. to force this stupid <laughs> eye shit after it. <laughs> Stink eye does not work, Keegan. I'm gonna ban you now. <laughs> no, it's nice. It's, it's a good looking car. Oh it. my it god, good. RB, you're getting banned too. He put S T I uh, with, yeah. the, with the word I. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that's pretty good. Hope it was worth it, dude. Move. <laughs> Enjoy your ban. 